I think I got one. I got one. Don't feel very big. But I didn't get skunked. How's that? Gonna start biting. Hmm? We'll see. Okay, there's another one. That feels a little better. There you go. That's what we're talking about right there. Hmm? Right there. Yeah, that's a nice one. That was a nice one. Okay. I'm gonna start biting now. That's two. Put this stake out pole on the kayak. This is the first time fishing with it. I keep bumping the thing with my rod. That's my last cast. I'll paddle back before it gets dark. Okay, one more. This is it. That's the spot right there. We'll see what happens. Yep. That's a little bigger. Oh, maybe not. He just got a little more fight in him. That's five. I can tick 
that hook a little. No, it's right there. free worm what's left of this one <coughs> this is my <coughs> Excuse me, this is my stakeout pole. So, it's just a uh, 10 foot piece of conduit. I got a rope on it, a little pool noodle in case I drop it in. It lays right here on the side. There's a little bungee that hooks it on. So, that's it. Hope you enjoyed. I'm going to I'll turn the camera around and then you can see the paddle in, maybe a little sunset, we'll see here. You might already see the sunset, I'm facing the wrong way. I'm going to turn you around. Well, I appreciate everybody coming along, kind of slow, five fish though. Oh, we still got, that sun's behind some clouds, see? I still have a little bit of time, but that's okay. I need to go back, get stuff put up, take a shower, edit this video so you can watch it tomorrow morning. I'm not sure what I'm doing tomorrow. I did build a new hand line. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm doing tomorrow. I build a new hand line. There's, uh, there's an awful lot of duckweed in my channel. I'll have to look and see what it looks like over on the uh, boat ramp is just over this way from me. Let's see what it looks like. There's always a ton of bluegill right there. So, I'm gonna go play with that hand line tomorrow and see what happens. Cooled off pretty nice tonight. That's probably what I'll be doing. I'll probably fool around with the hand line. I got a couple more mods I want to do to my kayak here. I put a I put a rod holder down here, but the rod holder is uh it's in my way. I need to slide it forward on the rail. I'm going to go back to the uh, bushcraft camp, do a little weed eating, straighten that up. Got a cooking video I want to do. I'm going to try to get that out next week. I got some of that. Carolina Chris made some gravy the other day. Patterson's, I think it's Patterson's, canned gravy, made in North Carolina, made here in the USA. So when I was just down in North Carolina, I went ahead and uh, my wife, I told the wife about it. She started looking, and it was, I think the Food Lion was the only store there close to my daughter that had it. So they went and got a couple cans. I think she got me three cans. I tried it the other day in the house. Good gravy. Do a little weed eating at the bushcraft camp, and then maybe we'll do a we'll do a breakfast over there. Go back here and make some uh, some bannock and try some eggs. 
warm up that can of sausage gravy. Light a lantern. Make a cup of coffee. I gotta try that. Uh, I gotta try Rat Pack's coffee they gave me. I haven't even done it yet. He roasted, he bought a roaster and he roasted some beans. He gave me a whole jar of them. I just haven't, uh, I just haven't had a chance to, to do it. So, right, I'll turn you back around. I'm done talking. We'll watch a little bit of this and then we'll be at the end. Like I said, thanks everybody for watching. Pretty out here at night. We'll see you on the next one. Everybody have a great week.